Don't call me cook. Time to get sauced up. Time to get sauced up. Time to get sauced up. I super say juice. No way, yeah. Time to get sauced up. Time to get sauced up. Time to get sauced up. Shouts out to everyone helping me keep the lights on over on the Patreon. That's where I have uncut reactions and exclusive content that does not come here to YouTube. Also, did you know we have a Discord community and also a Twitch channel where I go live reading manga and manhwa and also doing live reactions? You might want to join that. And last but not least, if you want to catch reactions here on YouTube early, become a channel member. Other than that, let's get this rocking. And we are back with another Food Wars reaction. This is definitely the show that I look forward to every time I sit down on this couch. Uh, and if you guys don't know, this is episode eight, which means if you're seeing this on YouTube, we watched this probably a month ago. So what I would recommend you do is join us on the Twitch. If you can't make the lives, it's okay. The VODs are over on Patreon weeks before they drop here on YouTube. So do yourself a favor. Join us here on Twist. The chat over here is going to let you guys know what's going on. Sauce of the chat for you boys. But last time, Meat Meat got destroyed. No pause, no ditty. Got destroyed. Right? Soma came through, smacked that meat down like a professional. Now, she's a part of the, she's a part of a whole club she didn't want to be a part of, but she was, my man called her sweet meat and she fell in love. So I'm like, okay, well, here we go. What's the next task though? Cause in my head, I feel like he's gonna be like, I feel like Soma is going to become the Luffy, so to speak of this world where he comes in with a whole new perspective and everybody just conforms to that. He's gonna come in and just make all these new friends based off of the basic meals that he makes. And people are like, oh my God, this is delicious, right? And sweet meat was the one. Erina, you know, she's still super salty. She's not gonna admit that my man is that nice, but her God tongue don't lie. She be, but she was lying to him. You know what I'm saying? So we're gonna continue this journey. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, hit the bell so you don't miss any future uploads. And like I said, if you wanna catch it early on cut, check out the page. Patreon. Chat, are you guys ready to go? Let's go. Ding! Some will prove they are worthy, and others are destined to fail. This is where fail. the killing begins. The killing begins. Okay. So I wonder what, what is going to transpire now. Okay. So this is one of those wilderness adventure schools or whatever. Uh, what's wrong with you, Megami? Hey, yo. Because she knows. This training camp is like a trip to hell. All mm -hmm. of the freshman students get sent to the mountains and are subjected to a whole oh. bunch of brutal tests. If you don't manage to pass everything, you'll be told to leave the academy. It's not that bad. <laughs> Just a little competitive education. In the words of the principal, this is when the process reveals the best of the best among us. Hmm. Yo, bro, didn't you go to that training camp last year? Even back then, dozens of students were forced to leave the premises, and a few others were even expelled. What expelled? Wow. Hey, uh... <laughs> okay, so we're allowed to bring our cards or even shogi, but not our cell phones. Wait a second here. This isn't enough time for us to bathe. Come on! Hey! You depart in three days. The students will assemble at 6 a.m. I see. That will be all, Hisako. Ah, <laughs> don't worry. I'm sure it won't be all bad. <gasps> That's awesome! Uh, this is where we'll be training? This school sure has money, all right. Do they own this giant hotel? Well, it might shock you, but Totski runs all the hotels around here. <laughs> that doesn't shock wow. me at all. <laughs> Whoa! Hey, it's Meet Me! Uh, hey, it's Meet Me! It's been a while. <laughs> How are you doing? <laughs> First of all, the fact that sh that he's not in the uniform and the fact that she's not is crazy. Like she got the skirt, but, but my man ain't in the uniform. Either. Right, meet me. Huh? Well, we'll give you that See? idea. Look how happy she you is. You will be staying here for six days and split into groups. You will tackle various food-related challenges as well as test the limits of your stamina. We have invited mm. some guest instructors who will act as judges for your challenges. Yes, oh. what kind of guests? Mm -hmm. Though they are incredibly busy, they have gathered here for this event. Please welcome the graduates of Totsuki Academy. 
Dude, they must be like geniuses to have actually graduated hmm? from Totski. You there, in the ninth row from the front, the young man with the cut over his brow. Huh? Yes, you. You're expelled. You may leave now. Uh what? Your hair product has a citrus aroma to it. That would mask the scent of your cooking, yes? <laughs> oh no, bro! This thing is that. Hey, you. Me? Nah, other nigga. Um, you got fruit shampoo, cuz. Yeah? Yeah, get the fuck out of here. <laughs> that shit is crazy, bro. For something like that? Something like that can be enough to lose customers. You little troll, are you out to destroy my restaurant? Get out of my sight. Uh, 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 Who is that? Hey, yo, bro. Chef Kojiro Shinomiya. He's the first Japanese chef to ever win France's Blue Sapore Award. Care to go back to my auberge, where we can talk till the sunrise? Huh? I, uh, excuse me, what was that? Oh, leave her alone, Chef Katoda. Somebody call Homeland Security and tell them they got Diddy's right hand man right here, bro. What is going on? Bro, bro, what is going on? She's the executive chef of the Totsuki Resort chain and sits on the board of directors, Gin Tojima. Hmm. Wouldn't it be crazy if this dude that he just hyped up knows fucking Soma's pops like, like, oh, I know this nigga. Like, oh, you got to, yo, you know what I'm saying? Somebody's got to know Soma's pops, bro. Soma's pops is that nice. But like Soma don't know how nice he is. You know what I'm saying? That's the crazy part. That's what I'm like. I'm like, okay, somebody's got to know his daddy. You know what I'm saying? Like you can't be that nice getting traveled back and forth to different countries to cook shit. You know what I'm saying? Oh, he's back. Oh my God. Like, oh shit. Somebody's got to know his daddy, bro. We're going to be treating you exactly as if you were employees at our restaurants. Do you know what that means? Anyone who does not perform to our liking. You're fired. Meaning you're expelled. So, you want a taste? I sure do. <laughs> Nigga, what is going on, bro? Okay, looks like we're all here. You're Soma Yukihira, aren't you? Huh? Uh, yeah, that would be me. <laughs> uh, that's over 10 seconds of foot grinding. I've been hoping to cross paths with you, buddy. But I never thought I'd get the chance on our very first challenge. Now I can finally destroy you. I'm glad it gets to be me who's gonna do it. Is that so? Well, I'm really happy for you. But if you don't move your foot, I'm gonna break it off. If there's the anything time. you don't understand, please ask. Um, Chef, you haven't given out any instructions on what you'd like for us to cook yet. Uh. My challenge for you today is to use the ingredients here to make a dish emphasizing traditional Japanese cooking. There isn't a supply of ingredients here. Well, of course there is. The bounty of nature's at your disposal and a clear stream with a wealth of options. You have seasonings, oil, and cooking utensils. Hey, that's dope. Hey, you gotta go outside and pick, get your own food, produce, meat. You can go as far as the fence. Crossing the fence will be an automatic failing grade. You get your ingredients solely from within the designated area and then cook with only them. Now get going and begin your journey. <laughs> huh? So did it just start? I think so. This lady's bonkers. I guess first we have to see if we can catch some fish. Bruh. Chef, I'd like for you to settle this. Huh? Tell us which of our what? dishes is more delicious. I'd like your impartial judgment. Huh? Why would I do that? That has nothing to do with this challenge, so no. Huh? <laughs> oh man, your face. Chill out. You don't have to get all worked up. It's making things uncomfortable. <laughs> you got one. No, nah, not a gigantic fish. To get some pretty good sized fish, huh? Oh, it was just the the angle. I was saying, I was like, goddamn. Mr. Impartial Judgment. Shut up. Just shut up. <sighs> Looks like you're one of the lemmings too, huh? The theme is Japanese, so everyone is going to use fish. Seems a little bit narrow-minded, if you ask me. We are doing duck. Uh, you were able to get duck? And that's not all there was. There were a few chickens and rabbits out there, too. <laughs> He's slicing the hey, uh... and thigh meat with such precision. Can I do something for you? Uh, no, I was just noticing how good you are You'll cut your body time. apart. Oh, you think so? Well, my brother over there is three times faster than me. Hey, yo. Uh... There are no 
slow breaks in his movement. Looks like this guy has what it takes. Huh? Those are hands that have obviously worked the line. Mm. My name is Takumi Aldini. This is my twin brother. I'm <laughs> Misami Aldini. The two of us have already worked in the kitchen of our local trattoria. You and I mm. aren't that different. I, as you, am a chef working to protect my family restaurant. Unlike what you said at the commencement. Still don't plan on losing to a bunch of wannabes who've never stood in front of a customer before. And as a fellow pro, yeah. I can't let myself lose to you. Aldini versus Yukihira. I'll show you who the real chef is here. I've been hoping for some hey. competition. Hey. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> what the heck is that? Moon and is primarily used in Italian cooking. He's reducing the ingredients to paste in seconds. The duck is just about done, Takumi. <laughs> <laughs> this is an herb grilled duck with a fresh green sauce on the side. Buon appetito. Buon appetito. The duck is so rich, brimming with the <laughs> taste of the wild. The combination of miraculous <laughs> elegance forms wave after wave reverberating to the depths of the stomach. She's about to start to sing an opera, cuz. <laughs> oh, Check out that green sauce he made. It's a salsa verde. It's a salsa verde. Takami Aldini. Isami Aldini. You both pass. Grazie. 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 He was able to use his wits to come up with some amazing food. That guy reminds me of. Mm -hmm. He's just like Soma. Mm hmm. Yeah. I like it. Let me just know posties. You know what I'm uh, saying? I don't know what this. Surprise. So look, bro. He said, "You see what's going on, bro." Like I love this because like. He's from the same the same same type of scenario. It's not like you have experience that I don't have in terms of like real practical application. I love that. So now it's like, all right, cool. You got a real a real rival that has done stuff that you've done in terms of like working in a restaurant, right? Not just studying in a classroom. So now he has somebody that he can actually like climb with. Cause that's gonna be the hardest thing, right? Like climbing by yourself, like, yeah, you wanna be the top, but you need somebody else that's also gunning for that. Because you have like Erina, right? Erina, obviously talented, but she doesn't wanna recognize him. She's already tasted his food, like, okay, nah. I don't want I don't want you in here because of whatever technicality, right? This guy has like the ability that he has in terms of being creative and X, Y, and Z. So it's like, all right, well, you need somebody that wants to strive for that same thing that comes from the same spot that you come from. This could be interesting. I'm really digging this. If you guys want to catch this early and uncut, if you missed the lives, check out the Patreon. Cause again, what we do here, we have over on Patreon. So you don't miss, don't, don't miss out. Y'all could be catching this way earlier. Uh, appreciate you guys for rocking with me today, boy. It's been a super fun one. And we will be back tomorrow with another reaction. Tomorrow we got Classroom of the Elite. We got 86. We're probably going to have another Food Wars. Um, and we're probably going to watch Go-Go Ranger. Go-Go Loser Ranger. So be here tomorrow, bro. Be here tomorrow. I'll catch you guys then. We out this day.